And we're back. My camera decided to stop recording all of a sudden, so now we're back to this. I hope this works. My phone's gonna be out of space for a week. Yes, he's down for the count, bitch. What's the intel? Ooh, interesting. Holy crap, my heart is beating so much that I think I might die. I kind of gotta ask, how does Max Brass not die? Like, that should have killed him, right? Eh, might just be me. But on the good news, we finally beat Headlock with Sprintron. Now I just need to beat it with all the other characters as soon as I'm able. I'm going to figure out how to kill them with, with Dr. Coyle, aka the slowest character. Alright, now we just need. And I think we may have. Yep. We have enough battery to kill Sprintron. So yeah, I hope, hope, hope anyone who's, I hope my family, assuming any of them is watching this, is proud of me, because this thing took a while to defeat. Oh my god. Yep, I'm the new champion. What do you gotta say about it? I'm still so proud of myself. And my robot son, because that is for a draw. You're doing amazing, sweetie. Good job. Because not only do I have another person I gotta fight, who I still need to fight because I forgot about him throughout the entirety of Grand Prix. But I also gotta show you a photo that gave me a reason to put Spring Truck from being a potential anti hero on the iceberg. I didn't add him on there for no reason, after all. Backer? 
kind of this cutscene, I think you can see the CR takes place in which I've since been referring to as Armsopolis, mainly because I don't know where Arms takes place, let alone when. So, judging by the time frame, it'd be around the 10 years. WAIT! Using the left analog stick, you can move the camera around. Now that's cool. Now that's a screenshot worth saving. I don't know how that's possible, but through the use of the left analog stick on your left-handed Joy-Con, you can actually they rotate the camera. That's sick. I also see a blink. What's my thing? I don't know how oh, this is even possible. But I still have someone to fight, and we have enough switch switch energy to do it. I feel like I might add this to the app version. Thanks for the MRT fan project I'm working on. The way Bandai Namco was part of this? They didn't know. Well, stay your boogie. Thanks. Alright, now. Here's why I was has been waiting through the credits. I mean, it's the second reason, but still, look closely. All right, just the camera. Yeah, this thing thing has gives me a reason to believe that Springtron's an anti-hero. Like, there is a chance he actually could be an anti-hero. So there is, a, so I might not be be wrong. We'll check out the gallery while we're here. Oh yeah, I forgot. And if you're wondering, yes, you can read, read you can check out your images in the gallery. This one's gotta be my favorite. And honestly, I don't blame Biff for, for thinking, oh my god, this guy's gonna kill the kid. Because, uh, this is the same guy who was wired or that potentially killed the original Kermit. At least I think that might be the case. And speaking of which... I forgot earlier. Alright. Time to kill the, oh, the fake one. It's over, Springman. I have the higher ground. Okay, maybe you have it, but you get my point. Just know that in my head, and I still don't hate you. And by the way, your hair looks like literal cold gate toothpaste. Like, no, seriously, that's a meme that exists. Google it. And, and you'll see what I mean. If it weren't for the fact that my laptop's nowhere near my desk, I'd probably see Google it and show it the literal footage of fans meaning this to death. And by fans, I mean fans of ours. Mainly because I only have two subscribers. At least as of me recording and uploading. Never mess with the your clone again. You'll find both equally awesome. Anyway. 
And that's it for now, so guess it's bye-bye time. Peace.